We are here at the beginning of the Koenigsee ice track. I have some ice shoes and we are about to meet Stephen Holcomb, many times champion from the United States, to walk the track with him and to see how he prepares for the training and the race. So tell me why we stop here. Um, so this is uh, going into corner S1. Uh, this is actually set you up for the next three corners and actually set you up for all your speed down the track. So this is a very important corner. You want to make sure you get the height in the corner beginning early and get the t sled turned in the right spot so that it's a very smooth transition between the S's and that you can come out of S4 straight and with some speed and uh, ideally that uh, will set you up for the rest of the track. If you mess up this little first couple corners then your race is over. It doesn't matter what you do down there. So so this is kind of straight why we stopped here. Uh, so this is, uh, the, it's, it's, it's a straightaway but it's not really straight which is kind of weird. Um, which is actually what makes it kind of one of the most important sections of the track. Um, this is the exit of the the S curves, this is S4, um, it's extremely important and during the race you'll see a lot of people come out and uh, either they'll hit this wall on the right side or and they go and go to a skid and then it's, the race is over. This is what I was talking about in the, in the corner before, this is what sets you up for all your speed because there's straight away you're not going anywhere, you're just trying to gain speed. The idea that I'm trying to do is to come around this corner and be a little more towards the left on this side and just so that way doing the, the, the straightaway bends around, we'll have an angle to be able to go without hitting the walls too hard, um, be pretty smooth and straight. If you come out along this side, um, it's really hard to make it around the bend without hitting the walls. This is the chicane, and as you can see, it's another one of those straightaways that's really not so straight. Um, it's actually very tricky to get through here. You're gonna hit this side right here, uh, no matter what. Uh, it's just a matter of hitting it as light as possible. So the idea is this is Kreisel comes around and we come shooting out of Chrysler into this at about 125 kilometers an hour and trying to get it weaved through here is very tricky but uh, the idea is just to come around just enough that you can just slip by the walls without and snake through without hitting the walls and and uh, if you hit down here you can lose a lot of speed because there's really not a lot more downhill and it's all uphill from here um, so it's very challenging and if you, if you nail this uh, you'll be fast in the bottom and hopefully you haven't lost lost a whole lot of time at the top too to, to keep you in the mix. So.